So CoCell is a program by Microsoft um, that essentially you can sign up for for free and how you how far you take that and how far you leverage that is completely up to you. So, for example, Cloud Direct have the highest co-sell accreditation. We are known as co-sell ready for all of our solutions, which, which essentially means uh, any customer that comes to us, we can work in conjunction with Microsoft straight away. So any customer that comes to us, we can call up Microsoft and say, we want to bring you in on this opportunity uh, and build a, a solution together. Obviously, that's a huge thing for, for customers. They want to have the prestige of working with somebody like Microsoft. But equally, um, it shows again that credibility that all the resources are available to them as part of their project. Two factors to this. Obviously, we've covered Partner Center. That's the platform to uh, to bring the sellers and, and partners together um, and, and customers together. And then the second side of things is being able to um, leverage Microsoft and the wider partner network through that partner center um, subscription. So within the partner center platform, you can see all your customers that you've co-sold with Microsoft. You can see how much cons Azure consumption that you've been able to um, bring to Microsoft. Uh, but you can also, also use other partners to be able to talk, to talk to them about integrations, talk to them about joint collaboration, um, and again, speak to the Microsoft wider um, network in terms of sellers. So the co-sell program is a great method um, for being able to really introduce Microsoft um, as a relationship into your organization and other partners such as us at Cloud Direct. You've got three options as a part of how you use Partner Center. Obviously, you've got the direct with the customer. So you build and publish your marketplace offerings and you go to market with that. Leads and opportunities automatically go into your Partner Center account. For those that have interacted with your postings and your um, your, your publications within um, the Azure marketplace and any sales that you've made, if you do have that automated process um, with regards to um, sort of uh, click and collect and, and, and basically um, consume straight away. So there'll be a, a, an overview of all the customers that you've brought on board. You can then configure and enable and invite um, other Microsoft partners such as us. So you can invite collaboration with anybody. Um, so again, it's a foot in the door with regards to making those um, initial sort of investigations into who you want to collaborate with from an integration perspective. And then you've also got a window to Microsoft sellers. So there are a huge amount of Microsoft sellers out there, thousands of direct Microsoft sellers that you want to engage with, because unless you're engaging with the very, very top 50 enterprise level organizations, Microsoft will always um, go through a partner to deliver solutions. So if a Microsoft seller has a particular partner or a particular customer, I should say, that they're managing or who comes to them looking for a solution, they will more than likely look to the channel to be able to fulfill that solution and work with you. Um, so in terms of that Microsoft uh, partner element, there's 90,000 partners out there. As I said earlier, there's only 70 Azure expert MSPs in the world. So again, a shameless plug of Cloud Direct, uh, to be honest with you. Uh, but in terms of your actual Azure environment and building that credibility, we are one of those 70 out of 90,000 uh, that you want to really work with in terms of the credibility of the, uh, the infrastructure around your application. In terms of Microsoft Scope, and again, getting an understanding of how Microsoft work, they split their accounts, their customers into three, enterprise, SMC, and SMB. There are around 13,000 enterprise accounts, about 36,000 corporate accounts, and there's about 78 million SMB accounts. And what Microsoft do they, is that they have structured teams um, aligned to each of these. So they will have a structured team around enterprise across the globe, a structured team around corporate or SMC as they call it, and a structured team around SMB. And what I mean by structured team is that they will have marketing resource, sales resource, technical resource, and pre-sales resource allocated to those segments that you can use and you can lean on to be able to drive growth of your application within Azure. So those teams are ready, waiting for you. We've used them ourselves as part of Cloud Direct's growth. So we have definitely benefited from our relationship with Microsoft as an Azure expert MSP. There are, as we said before, there are multiple leads that we get on a monthly basis, a huge amount, I won't say how many, but a huge amount of leads that we get on a monthly basis due to our relationship with, with Microsoft. 
So how do you engage with Microsoft sellers? Essentially, the hard work, the, the journey that we've been on uh, can be made easier as a as an application or ISV provider by partnering. So we already have a number of relationships already in place. So sellers will be aligned to segment. So that's not just on the size of the organization. They will also be vertically aligned. So in terms of which sector that they operate within, finance, retail, manufacturing, whatever it might be. And the key thing to get across to Microsoft sellers or to um, what they're interested in, and again, this is a little bit of internal insight that you won't get from the Microsoft site, is that they are targeted on ACA and ACR. And essentially what that means is Azure customer ads. So how many new customers are, are in Azure? and Azure consumed revenue. So how much revenue they have generated that month in Azure. So new Azure revenue. Um, that's what they're targeted upon. So they are very interested in talking to any partner that can help them hit target. So if you've got an application that you've designed for Azure, that's going to be the next best thing in hotel management, for example, um, and that you think is going to really take off, they will want to hear about it. They will want to take it to their customers and they will want to take it to any opportunities that they have. So the key thing there would be let's talk to the SMB and SMC or even enterprise, depending on where your application um, sits. Um, let's look at all the people or the, all the micro sellers who are aligned to that vertical. So the hospitality industry, for example, and let's start to get this in front of them. And we can make that happen because we've already got those relationships in place. Our sellers on our side and our marketing team, so myself, we are already um, in close relationship with Microsoft. We're already um, essentially we go as far as being as vertically aligned to Microsoft as 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 we can be in terms of we have sellers that match those verticals that Microsoft have um, and they will regularly speak to those Microsoft sellers on a weekly basis. I have weekly calls as part of my role with the product marketing teams at Microsoft as well. So those are the ways that you can speed up your application sales by introdu us introducing you or if you want to do it yourself, obviously you can, but it's a bit harder to do so. Um, introducing yourself to those sellers because you need they are vertically aligned. But the key way of getting that mind share from them is to really show them how they can benefit from Azure consumption. And what does that actually mean from an incentives perspective? Um, so the more that you bring to Microsoft, because um, obviously it's a two way street in terms of you selling more of your application in turn that introduces more Azure revenue, whether that's you spending more on Azure because you've got more customers or you're introducing more customers to Microsoft from a, an Azure perspective, they will incentivize you. So as soon as you exceed 100,000 US dollars in ACR, uh, Microsoft will incentivize their sellers as well as yourself. So not only do they give you kickbacks um, in terms of rebates, marketing funds, sales funds, they will also incentivize their, their um, selling teams to sell your product. So for example, um, Cloud Direct, we have our provide portal, which is essentially a portal for all our customers to track their Azure spend, track um, their support tickets. It's a basically a single pane of glass for everything Azure that they can use to understand where they are from a performance perspective, forecasting perspective. It's a really useful tool um, and something that sets us apart from other partners. But we, um, because of how many customers we have, Microsoft sellers are incentivized to um, promote Cloud Direct in the sense that they will get 10% additional commission for introducing Cloud Direct because we have this um, IP co-sell on our provide portal. And that's something that you can get as part of your applications as well when you get to that size. So not only can you say to a person in the hospitality industry, look, Mr. Microsoft seller, all of your hospitality customers, we've got this application that's going to drive more Azure revenue. It's going to help them in terms of their operations. This is what the application does, yada, yada, yada. We've introduced AI um, and IoT into it, and that's again going to drive more Azure consumption. You actually get paid more if you, in, if you, um, if you sell our product. So it's a really good way of, um, again, accelerating those sales. And then Finally, from a uh, from a sort of a Microsoft perspective, how do you get started? Well, enroll with Partner Center. It's completely free. Sign up with that link there. 
But again, as I say, the key thing is a lot of this stuff is publicly available information in terms of the slides, but the additional content that I'm giving you as I'm talking is through our experience of being on that Azure co-sell journey for the last 15 years um, and obviously building up those relationships. So the co-sell playbook is available uh, in these slides as well as the, obviously the link to sign up within Partner Centre. Um, but obviously I would always say engage with Cloud Direct um, because we can make help you make the very most of that um, Azure co-sell journey.